DOG Sports locked out here in Culver City, California. Rick Strong with you. Jim Rome's show is on Showtime, and he had Brendan Iambadejo, Tom Tolbert, and the controversial, highly outspoken mixed martial artiste, Shale Sonnen. Now, he went on to attack LeBron James when Jim Rome tried to bring up the topic. He did bring up the topic successfully, obviously. Here's what Shale Sonnen said. You guys can give me your take after I read you the quote. So here we go. Uh, Shale Sonnen on LeBron James. I think LeBron's a dork. He won one world championship, and that was in the Olympic Games. It's so aggravating to hear a title be called a world champion when it's only done in America, Merck. It's not a global event where the world, the whole world, can participate. You didn't win a world title. You won a national title. And then Tom Tolbert, the former professional basketball player, went on to say, I'm absolutely impressed with him. And he said he wasn't in favor of the decision, which I agree with. However, he did come around to say, and this is Tom Tolbert again, that he was impressed with him and he is certainly turned uh, uh, a new page in his career, becoming that great basketball player. By the way, being a dork has actually worked out for LeBron James. I don't know, he just won an NBA championship, he has an Olympic gold medal, and he's won the MVP four times, and on the Forbes list, he is the number four highest paid athlete. What a famous and great dork he is. Then Shel Sonnen went on to say this, he's a nerd. You got this guy, LeBron's a wimp. You got this nerd named Ray Lewis. It's like if I saw these guys, I'd smack them both. Why was that needed? <laughs> I know that Chael Sonnen is, again, outspoken, he's critical, and he's tough. And that's certainly what drags you in. I mean, I remember even on ESPN when he grabbed Sage Steele's hair, and he, he, he basically dissed the people of Brazil. However, he then clarified and said, your women are okay. I'm just uh, not in favor of a man who sits a few feet away from me. That was Anderson Silva, who he lost two times to. He has a uh, matchup with Shogun Rua, Mauricio Shogun Rua. I believe that is August 17th. On Fox Sports 1, the new launch of Fox Sports 1. We're all awaiting that with Regis Philbin. No, but, I mean, overall, are, do you agree with him? Do you think that it should be called a world championship? Look, the best players are playing not only in the Olympics, but if you want to combine all of them into one league, it's called the National Basketball Association. He has won in both. So, uh, again, that's just, my, that's just my take. However, a few of the people who chimed in on the original video, which we can throw in the description below, here's what they said. This is really interesting. Commenter Brown Dripperoos, which sounds incredibly dirty, said Shell Sonnen is the Detroit Pistons of his sport. Huge freaking diss. And then Jay Brimhall says, regardless of whether or not Shale is quote-unquote right about LeBron, I'd choose the American gangster in a scrap with, uh, without dedicating any thought to it. Obviously. I would take him over LeBron. I'd take him over Ray Lewis. I'd probably take him over 99% of the guys in the NBA. But that's just me with their fists, obviously. So, uh, as I said, yes, it is August 17th. I just wanted to clarify uh, against uh, Shogun Rua. So, are you in favor of Shale Sonnen? Are you in favor of LeBron James? Leave a thought in the comments section below. Give us a thumbs up, share with your friends, and subscribe to TYT Sports.